Unilever is a global uh, consumer goods multinational. Uh, we operate in 180 countries across the world, employing 167,000 people. Some of the brands that we're known for across the globe include Dove, Vaseline, Knorr and Hellman's, and also our ice cream brands such as Magnum. We also have what are known as local jewels, which are specific to local markets. And in the UK, these would include things like Coleman's and also our detergent brand, Persil. I'm responsible for the contemporary art collection in our head office in London and then I have a team based in Port Sunlight who are responsible for our, for our historical archive collections and also our semi-current records in the records management unit. Within the um, records department the sort of records we're keeping range across the board um, everything that's produced in the everyday working environment in the global head office from copies of the board minutes through to marketing records, examples of packaging, advertising, presentations, reports, a whole range of records. The relationship between Records Management Archives is a seamless one. Um, by managing the records efficiently in the Records Management Unit, we can ensure that at the end of their legal retention span, we can select them and preserve items that we think are of historical benefit permanently. Keeping the records long term as opposed to in the records management unit but moving on to historical archives is important because if you don't preserve them your historical memory will be at risk. A specific example of this would be with a toothpaste carton which had a shade card on the side to show the whitening effect of toothpaste which Unilever had developed but a competitor in another market was trying to say they had developed themselves. We were able to find the only example of this within our archive uh, and thereby saving the Unilever millions of dollars. Currently we've got about 12,000 records management boxes. I believe that equates to about 6 million pieces of paper. We keep track of everything in the data centre by using live link records management. The process for sending records to us starts with a transfer form online which will kick off a workflow in live link so that we know to expect these records. The transfer form is something that we've developed ourselves um, to use within LiveLink. We've made other customizations as well. We've created a customized DRO homepage to make it easier for them to navigate directly to their own records and not have to mine through all the different levels of LiveLink. Once the records are received here, the contents are checked against the transfer form to make sure that everything is in place. The items and the box are all then barcoded to facilitate their retrieval in the future. We also use LiveLink to notify us in, uh, when documents are reaching the ends of their retention periods so that we're able to notify the owners and they can review whether they wish to keep those or need to keep those records for any longer period. Unilever was only formed in 1930, but some of the companies that went to make up Unilever have a much older heritage. Our oldest brands in the UK include Pears Soap and Carmen's Mustard, which go back to the 18th century. Surprisingly, the oldest document in our historical collection dates back to the 1200s. It is a small deed relating to the site of the Carmen's Mustard Factory. We decided to use LiveLink from OpenText because it was the software package that most closely fitted our requirements. Reliability of the service is very good because it's hosted for us by OpenText. I think for us it has a very good search facility which means that even if the users haven't given us as much information as they maybe should have done, we can still find data for them. Compared with how we first ran records management uh, before we had a software system and we had to do everything manually, um, and even with an access database, now we save so much time. I was extremely surprised to be told that we'd been nominated for a, a Global Star Award. It would make a really big difference winning this award because recognition of what we do and how we've developed the products is a big thing for us. We could also use it as an enormous PR opportunity to promote our service within Unilever and show our customers how well recognised we are too.